Hello everyone, welcome to my Sims 3 University Let's Play. I am Psycho Kitty Plays and uh, I hope you will enjoy this. I've been waiting for this expansion pack pretty much ever since I saw it announced back in last fall sometime, I believe it was. And so far, I am really enjoying it. I have tried playing with, just testing it out with a couple other sims other than my household uh, that I'm going to be using for university and uh, it does have some glitches but nothing bad, nothing I can't handle so far unless something major turns up now as for my sims I do have them pre-made so I will not be doing create a sim um, there you can see them right there and um, because there's just everybody is doing creative sims anyways and I'm sure everybody can describe all those items that are there so much more better than I can. And now about my household, um, they are sisters and uh, I don't have much of a backstory for them. They were, let's just say they were from, originally from Bridgeport, let's say about, let's say that. And um, I had thought about it a little bit but yeah, like I said, I don't have much of a backstory for them yet. All I know is um, what I've thought about was they probably wanted to move out to a different place as soon as they graduated from high school and they decided to go to college together. So there we go. I'm going to load up their family, which might take a while, and I will get back to you once I can actually introduce you to them. All right. Bye. Alright, so welcome back to my family. And as you can see, we have two sisters right here. They are Cassidy and Bailey O'Connor. And uh, they live in Aurora Skies right now. That is just until we get our friendly mascot to drop off our aptitude tests and such. Um, I actually just moved them in here. And um, oh, I'm going to go over the traits. Cassidy. Well. Okay, they are actually twins. Non-identical, obviously. Let's see if I can get a better look at them. This is Bailey. And uh, she looks so much better in, better in Create a Sim because my graphics are not the best at the moment. Like I said in a previous little log update video, she is... She... <laughs> what? Yeah, don't mind that. I am using a laptop, so obviously my graphics are not set to the highest. So, and this is Cassidy. Um, okay, up to the traits. She's flirty, great kisser, a bookworm, irresistible, and charismatic. Now, um, irresistible is one of the new traits that came. I was three. There was irresistible, there was avant-garde, and there was socially awkward. And Cassidy's favorite music is electronica, food is pancakes, and she likes the color aqua. And her lifetime wish is to be a Star News anchor, so she's going to go for the communications, I think. We're going to try to go for the communications. Bailey, on the other hand, wants to go for the business career. Um, she wants to be a CEO of a mega corporation. Her traits are good sense of humor. Uh, genius, which is actually supposed to help with the business degree thingy. She actually does have the avant-garde as well, so she will be an artistic, artistic businesswoman. Artistic and friendly are her the two traits. I did not give her the socially awkward one because I want her to be able to, like, enjoy her little pixel life while being a the university. She likes indie music, fruit parfait, and the color lilac. Okay, and uh, they are both wearing university clothes right now, except Cassidy's boots, they are custom content from a safe website, <laughs> may I add. Um, but yeah, okay, Cassidy's clothes. I love the back of this shirt. It's like so, I don't know, kind of crazy. Um, ready to wear for Bailey, completely university. 
she looks very preppy and just, you know, nice overall. Okay, now let's wait for the mascot. Come on. Should be here soon. I just moved them in here anyways. I haven't really done anything, but just, they are in a one-bedroom house. But come on, they can share a room. They're sisters. Who cares? They have, like, two single beds here. So... Okay, where is... Come on! Yeah, go talk about books or something. Learn writing skill, maybe. Pick a class? No. Learn science skill? I don't know. Wall in university? Oh, yes. Oh, street art, definitely. See? Billy wants to do street art already. Come on, where is the mascot? Where are you? Newspaper kit. Aha! Here we go. Here is Mr. Mascot. Come on. Come on. We need our gift basket. Come on. <laughs> I love the way he walks. Oh, he's a... Level 10 jock. Okay. Hi, your friendly Sims University mascot is here to spread some school spirit. I also bring the University Welcome Kit, which has useful university information and fun freebies. Exactly the person, llama creature, we have been waiting for. Come on, now give us the basket so we can get our freebies and take our tests. Come on. Thank you. And... Both Cassidy and Madeline are going to get some freebies. Come on, girls. Get some freebies. Oh, got some stuff. Okay, she got a poster, I think. Now, if you could move. Oh, that's a shirt and a flag. A banner. Eh, duh. Okay. Go out of the way. Go here. Move your sister wants to get stuff too. You can actually start taking your aptitude test. And t-shirt and banner for Cassidy. Yep. Alright, and you take your test too. Cassidy has some sweet new gear. Alright. Hmm. Look very thoughtful. <laughs> the mascot is just standing there completely ignoring everybody. Come on. I can't <laughs> click with my middle mouse button. Okay. Oh, okay, here's babies. Got a partial scholarship for fine arts. For some, are you serious? I wanted to go for business. She sucks at business. No way. Um, I guess we'll be taking fine arts then. She got six extra credits. Okay. Um. <laughs> Alrighty, Bailey. Oh, the new phones, I have to show off the new phones, they're awesome. Also, they have a... Oh, finally. Cassidy did not get a scholarship. Really? <laughs> okay, um... However, her highest scoring subject is communications, which is what I was planning to do. Okay, good. Okay, smartphones. These things are awesome. I'm gonna have to show them off later. They also get like a Canon camera. Hey, hey, hey! What are you doing? And whoa! Girl? Bailey? Yeah, both of you. Okay, Cassidy. So. 
Bailey. Fine Arts, then. I'm gonna have them do two terms on a light load, so they wouldn't really have to... Eh, go to many classes. Go to too many classes, and they could just, like, chill a little bit. Go to juice cake parties and such. Anyways, communications, let's see. Really? No. Okay, communication degrees will give Sims an instant level boost and higher pay in journalism, political, and fortune telling. Okay, cool, because Cassidy wants to be in journalism. Fine Arts will give Sims an instant level boost and higher pay in music, culinary, or film. Where I wanted to go to business. It's so funny how business and criminal careers are right next to each other. <laughs> I'm not even going to say anything about that. Alright, fine. We'll do fine arts for Bailey. <laughs> They're going for two terms. And... Yeah. Lightest load of credits and classes for each of them. Okay. Accept. Here we go. Oh. Great, they got a hundred some points <laughs> each. That's useful, definitely. I'm not gonna play the door, I'm not gonna have a fortune told. What the heck is this? Come on, time to go. Time to go. Get your stuff and get out. Yeah, yeah, neighbors. Could not be less interested. Oh, there they go, their little suitcases. Oh, there's a ghost floating on the street. <laughs> a ghost named Oscar. Hmm. Alright, and off we go to college. University, I'm sorry. Oh yeah, as you can see, I'm in our skies. And there we go. Loading screen for this baby. I hope it's not going to take for half an hour or something like that. It actually might for me because it's just kind of what it does sometimes. But let's take a moment just to appreciate the look and feel of the buildings here. They are just so gorgeous. They remind me of... I don't know what they really remind me of. Like Victorian era or something like that. New England. Something like that. Very high and like universities. Like... Can't think of any American ones that I can bring up as a reference. Whatever. Fail. <laughs> but yeah, the buildings look gorgeous and I will have the girls move into a sorority actually. Because I feel like everybody's doing dorms. I don't know if anybody is doing sororities out there. Or fraternities. So yeah, I'm just gonna have them go to a sorority, see what's going on there. I pretty much know all the housing options available. Other than the houses for rent, those I have not touched with, fiddled with in the game. Um, or fraternity. And yeah, I haven't played in a sorority. I haven't seen the inside of one. Wait. I have. Sorry, lied. Because I'm playing with another sim. <clears throat> Excuse me. Talking too much isn't. <coughs> Okay, talking too much is not good for your throats. This is my body telling me to shut up and go to sleep. Which I'm not gonna do just yet. Um, okay, I have seen the inside of a sorority building and it was way nicer than a dorm actually. Which you would of course expect. Okay, there we go, little loading bars going faster, finally. Well... Um... Also, social groups. I think Cassidy's gonna be in the jocks social groups because she's like charismatic and irresistible and all that. And Bailey, I'm not so sure about. I think since she's in the fine arts, she's gonna be a rebel slash nerd. You can be all three if you want to, but 
I think we might try the rebel thing. Yeah, probably. Now if the loader would just... Oh, and there we go. First full view of the city. That is so much greenery. And... Are my sims here? Yes, they are. Hello, ladies. I am going to put you here. Sorority house. Actually, I'm going to preview a lot first. I'm not going to have them rent a house because that would be ridiculously expensive and I want them to have money left over for when they come home. Okay, um, I see a bonfire pit that out back. A pool. Nice. So it would only load a little. There we go. Okay, preview the inside of the house. Well, it's barely loading, but that's pretty much what I'm talking about. Just nicer looking. Not so... Yeah, <laughs> like the dormitories. Because <laughs> honestly, the dorms are really annoying. Someone was blasting music and I couldn't turn it off. Ugh. Ooh, they have a good fridge. Oh, they have a very good stove. No fires. Good. Any parking spots? Should have bought a car. Okay, bookshelves, fireplaces, really good TV. We are going here. Alright. Loading. Saving, loading, something, something. Um, come on. Got stuck a little bit. Okay, there we go. Now, see, welcome to the university. Check out the academics panel to monitor your academic progress during the term. And don't forget to check your class schedule so you're not tardy to your first class. Don't be tardy to the party. Okay, class schedule communications. Monday, Wednesday, Friday, everything is at 8 in the morning. I feel for you, Cassidy, you little pixel person, you. Wow. That's bad. Oh, Bailey has it a little better. Everything starts at noon. Okay, here are all the lectures. What did she get, though? Okay, she has the sketchbook and a rhythm and poet the, the rhythm and poetry of art. Okay, and she has a street art kit. Okay, cool. And Cassidy here has it's kinda interesting I'll have to just check their names right there. <laughs> has a frequency fun mobile radio station that she can like just use out and about to get her skill and grade up and also a book all right oh, go away notification all right i'm gonna go and claim their rooms living in norms now that you have arrived you may want to take a minute to select the bed you want to claim and decorate your room. Don't forget to set the lock options on your door if you prefer to keep out visitors. No, I really want other sims to sleep in my sims bed at night. So... Okay, how many? Oh, that's it. Um... This is kinda nice. This room right here. I'm gonna take that room. It's a computer dresser. But the heck is that bookshelf? This is a dresser. It has a fireplace in it. Come on. Yeah. I'm totally taking this. Of course, I could just take one of those rooms and put single beds in them, but... Um, why bother? Why bother? I kind of like the wall color in this one, so... Mm. Cassidy gets this stripy bed. Unless I, of course... 
Oh, they're going to the student. Oh, they're just arriving. Supply ownership. Daily. Okay, now I need to lock out the door. Uh, specify Sims. Sims who cannot open. This chick, this chick, this chick, this chick, this chick whose last name is Gangnam. I wonder, would she marry a guy whose name last name is Style? And then would have to hyphenate? Her name would be Ye Gangnam Style. Hmm. Interesting. <laughs> okay. Oh man, I forgot to do my options. Okay, hold up really quick. I wanted to turn off Hail and Rain, and as you can see I have Supernaturals completely turned off. I don't know, I just don't like my roommates turning into vampires in the middle of the night. Who <sighs> witches. And then putting some weird hexes on. No, don't like that. Alright, so take a look at this punch here. She's a jock. Oh, I was right. That one's a jock. Let's see, rebel. Attention property owner. Uh huh, yada yada. Go bye bye. Need a local. What does this girl want to do? She wants to also need a local. Well, that shouldn't be too hard, considering the whole town is full of locals. Okay, she's a rebel. Yay, Gangnam. Yi Gangnam? Am I saying her name right? I don't know. Northern Europe here. Okay, so we have rebels and jocks in the sorority building. Why is my mailbox glowing? Probably because of the check job board thingy mobob. I'm gonna redecorate actually a little bit later. Oh, she wants to meet a jock. Definitely. She wants to meet a nerd. Girl, what? No. You're gonna be our rebel. I'm gonna go make a silly face to your sister instead of meeting new people at college. <laughs> okay, I am actually going to go take a little break and decorate the room because uh, university did come with some nice things. And I would just like to show them off and just make their lousy little room look better. Alright, be right back. Okay, and I am back with the finished room. Oops. <laughs> and uh, there we go, this is it. I actually did not end up using so many items from university life. Just because... Mm, I don't know. So, this is what it looks like. These decorations, however, are from university. And it was this little wall thingy. And uh, I didn't really change up a whole lot, just mm, the beds and... Well, I actually gave them new beds. So this is Cassidy's and this is Bailey's. And uh, these lamps are from university as well. I also gave them each a laptop. Just in case. And uh, this is what they look like. This is Cassidy's and uh, yeah. Bailey's is actually like red pink or something like that. What? And it's pretty cool. It's not that expensive either. It's like a couple thousand simoleons compared to the other laptop that's like 4,000 or something like that. Alright, so yeah. That is their room. Okay, I'm gonna go and have Cassidy meet someone who is a jock. It's probably downstairs. Ah, this chick is a little thin jock right here. Ashley De Sorrento. Okay, uh, let me introduction her. And she wants to meet a nerd. I don't think there were any nerds here. So, I'm gonna just have her chat with a rebel. What's that chick's name? Shannon. Okay, go talk to Ch Shannon here. Wait, what are you? Nope, I'm nerd. Okay, um... 
Wait. Where the heck did that chick go now? Really? Really? Hmm. Well, I suppose we we'll have to go to the student union sooner or later anyway, so. Okay. Gonna have a chat with what's her face, Jock Chick, Ashley. See if she can get enough, uh, what's his face? <laughs> Influence to gain the social group. Um, get to know. Talk about university, I guess. Um, there's some weird new options here. Okay, joke about professors. Show funny video. Show internet cats video. Tell a funny story. Sure. Where? Who is that? Hannah. Level 2. Level 2 rebel. Ugh. Well, she's being a... <clears throat> not so nice word. I'm trying to tone down the cursing thing here. A little bit. Just a little bit. Not too much. So there's like nobody else to talk to. Okay. How about this one? Friendly introduction her. Um. See if this chick was actually nicer. Alrighty. Ask about the... <laughs> Ask the sketch no. no. Wait, is she a... She's not in any group, so why does she get little options? Okay. Let's do that one. Get to know. Juggle professors. Make silly face. Show cat video. Alright, let's see. And there we go, some kind of computer stereo or something blasting. Ugh. Okay, it looks like they are actually getting friendlier. Alrighty, looks like Cassidy here is a level one jock. Jocks are a highly are a socially motiv motivated group that are great at balancing the social life with other needs. Okay. Cassidy O'Connor gained enough jock influence to join the social group. I can't repeat right now. Okay, she wants to buy a tennis table. We might. And then title by increasing jock influence. Also, another way to do that is if you have like 2,000 lifetime reward points, you go to lifetime rewards and you can buy influence. Okay, so for example, Cassidy has 3,000 points. Um, and uh, I'm gonna purchase some jock influence for her. Okay, now let's see. Whatever I bought, it's making this social group take me Take extra notice of me. I feel so popular. Cassidy O'Connor is now an in-crowd newbie. Wanna be? Oh. Play sports at the stadium. Okay. Okay. And now she's a level three jock. See? This is a bit way too easy, actually. What? Billy being impolite. Really? Jerk. 
Uh, Cassie O'Connor is now wingman within the Jock Social Group. Okay. Perform school cheer. Well, yeah, we can totally do that now. Um, oops, no knock on this. Do school cheer and we take the photo together. Come on, don't crush on me. Ugh, meet and greet. Alright, let's go check it out. Get some candy and sodas. Then do school cheers. Oh, chicken. Blech. Take a photo with a friend. Okay. What? Oh, so the sorority girls, girls can just borrow cars like that. That's nice. <laughs> that is awesome. Okay, come on, let's lag in here now. After the meet and greet, I am going to actually end up finishing this episode because the computer is lagging just a bit. Okay, I'm gonna let this load. Okay, this is the lecture hall. Um, one time I had an invisible professor here, but the lecture still took place. So this is a glitch that EA has to fix. I think... Yep. Okay, this is the science -y stuff. I'm not really sure what that is. You can research science on it. It looks scary. I'm getting claustrophobic just by looking at that thing. Okay, just the computer, yeah, some whiteboards. Alright, get freebie, poster, candy bar, soda, flying disc, and a kicky bag. Alright, you go get a freebie too. Candy bar, oops, don't talk to the professor. Soda, get freebie flying disc, get freebie kicky bag, and a poster. Okay, who are their professors anyway? Okay, this chick lady is my uh -huh, Bailey's professor. And Cassidy's is Billy Jean, level 10 nerd. Okay. Hmm, I wonder if there's any plant sims hanging around here. I've seen them around town. And they are really cool. Oh, this is Mr. Mr. Llama here. Oh, this is the professor right here. Oh, already? Um, let's check out upstairs. Ah! Scroll you. Here are what the vending machines, right? Cool. I'm gonna see if we can get something free out of them, even though it might crush and kill us. Okay, soda machine. Slam machine. Lost you. You wanna get a freebie too? Okay. Um. Should I just cancel something? Okay. Let's risk life and death. <laughs> Shake the machine. Come on. Oh no! Don't fall! <gasps> Slam it. <gasps> ah! Okay, slam. Uh oh, slam it again. You too. <laughs> Terror twins. <laughs> Come on, three sodas. Slam the machine. Bailey too. Oh my god, it looks like it's about to fall on me. Ooh, she got one. Cassidy got one. Alright, Bailey. 
You go. You're next. Ooh. Did we get something? Yes, we got a free soda. Okay, what do we get? Okay, we got a... The new Glunka soda. <laughs> Whatever that is. Imagine what would happen if I were to sell this car right now. They'd be set for college and beyond. God, I am so tempted. Oh, and Cassidy got the mountain runoff. Okay, I know what they mean by the actual drink, but I don't know how to say that. Rune off. <laughs> Run off, I guess. Mm, should I sell that car? It's 85,000 simoleons. I'm gonna do it, you guys. I'm gonna sell that car. Well, I can actually buy nice things for the sorority house with that, right? <laughs> I am such a horrible person, but I'm gonna sell that car. 85,000 simoleons. Bye! <laughs> Ooh, I am a horrible person. Okay, this chick's a jock. She was actually pretty nice. I might as well talk to her. Actually, I'm gonna end this part right here, like, I should probably end it when they go to bed or something, but, nah, oh, 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 okay, also something new, um, buy a snack, brownie, cookie, donut, bagel, muffin, key lime pie, cheese, danish, slice of cake, buy a drink, organic brews, organic Kona lift, Organic Midnight Mud, Organic Cortado, what the heck is that? Organic Red Rocket, Organic Maui Slabuccino, Herbal Teas, Ginseng, Sweetgrass, Cinnamon, Basil, Lavender, Peppermint, Wonder Petal, Chamomile, Bumble Leaf, Green Leaf, Licorice, Buzzberry, that gets you buzzed, I don't even want to know. Hey, I was clicking on energy drinks, Chamomile Kick. Green leaf of Palooza. What? Garlic? Garlic? No. I am not even gonna. Hot beverages. Uh, the usuals. So I'm gonna have the girls actually eat. Buy a snack. Um. Bailey is going to buy a cheese danish. And. Grr. Mouse, stay still, you. Cassidy is going to buy a donut. Alright. There are just some of the new foods. Um, in the instant foods, they also have... In the fridges. They also have green salad and yogurt, I believe. I don't know if there's anything else. Come on. Oh, Cassidy O'Connor has been invited to a bonfire party already. New party invitation. Sunday at 7.42 p.m. Why such weird times? That's in our own dorm. Um, I'm sorry, not dorm. Sorority. Alright, I'll be there. Cassidy was invited to a party. Oh, and so was Bailey. Good. Cool. We're gonna go to a party in the next part. Give us our donut! Garrison Fort! Come on! Seriously, is that guy like half asleep? Give us our freaking donut! No? Cut. I should have them just jump you right there and just pummel you. Yeah, I'm gonna just take a silly photo series with Bailey, and then you photo both. Come on! Get in there! And make some stupid faces. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Bailey, get! Come 
see, like, this is another glitch. Not selling you food or drink. Okay, what is with that? Who's playing the friggin' violins? <laughs> what? Please don't tell me that's a thing. Okay, got pictures. Somebody's playing classical music. What? The photo was taken and placed into your room, Tori. I know that. Can we take a picture? Friendly. Get to know she's your sister. Why would you get to know her? You're a twin. Take a photo with her. I wonder if they're gonna be like duck facing or something. Probably. Oh! And this I need to get screen capped. Oh my god. That is so wrong. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Okay. Wow. Alright, I'm gonna have the girls head home. Back to their sorority. Where they can chill a bit before a party. Wow, Cassidy's a level 4 jock. Okay. That is interesting. She could buy more influence already. Okay. Let's get out of this violin happy place. Okay, go, go, don't get stuck. Run. Need to buy more cars. <laughs> or I can just sell all the cars in the lot. Wait, what is that? Bailey, what are you driving? Bailey's driving a pretty expensive car too. <laughs> well hey, what the heck was I supposed to do with that? thing is just sitting there in your inventory. How am I not supposed to sell that? They were broke. In my own def defense here. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and end the part here and in the next part we're probably gonna have the bonfire party and some juice kegs that I have to set up. And uh, we shall see what else will happen. Probably. Probably something. Yep. All right. Um. All right. Well. Uh. Okay. All the game is paused right now. So. I will talk to you guys soon, and I hope you enjoyed this part. I hope it's not too long. If it is, whoops. That happens to me a lot. <laughs> I don't really look at the clock, even though I could and should. So I hope you enjoyed this part and I hope you stay tuned for the next part as well. Bye!